All right. It is not for me to say whether you've done this or not. <laughs> but picking your nose actually leads to Alzheimer's disease. That's what is being touted online. Yeah, I heard that today, and I immediately thought of some friends that I have. I'm a little <laughs> concerned. Uh, my company is not always highbrow. No, nope, okay? really. <laughs> so this is a theory that's going on um, for an Australian researcher, and they're suggesting that the two are linked. Mm -hmm. So think twice before you go digging for gold next time. That's one, one of the ways or to we, refer Monica? to picking your nose, right, Monica? This is one of those stories where I'm just going to say, slow your roll. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> okay right. that works. So, yes, it is a theory. It is likely a plausible one, but nose picking causing Alzheimer's, that's a pretty big jump. Now, you've probably done it since you were a kid, and even now, sometimes those nose, nose boulders need to get plucked. But <laughs> oh. a recent review paper published in Biomolecules looked at the potential relationship of the habit to dementia, which may be related via neuroinflammation or the swelling of nervous tissue, including tissue in the brain. And a dirty finger up your nose is certainly one way pathogens could potentially reach your brain. They're suggesting that infectious agents that are in the environment um, do have access to the brain through the nerves um, of the smelling system that poke through into the upper reaches of the uh, sinuses. And um, yeah, a lot of people think a lot of things might get in that way. So wash your hands. That's a, that's a very good recommendation. Always it is. Now, the report did not present any new evidence obtained through an experiment. They just gave an overview of other studies. So while the study authors suggest a connection, they certainly did not prove one, and currently there is no cause and effect proven relationship at this time. Now, researchers have spent years trying to figure out what causes dementia. Many believe there is no one single cause, but aging is a definite risk factor, as are genetics, lifestyle, environmental exposures, and other medical problems, such as metabolic syndrome, which we know is a trigger. That's the combination of obesity, hypertension, diabetes, and high cholesterol. So if you have those things, get your numbers under control. So are you telling my friends mm -hmm. that it's okay to continue picking their nose? You're asking for a friend, aren't you? For a you? friend, yeah, yeah okay. totally. <laughs> How many times in 26 years have I told you, wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. <laughs> a million. Do not touch your nose, your face, your yeah. eyes, your mouth, especially this time of year. Because, yeah, dirty fingers up your nose can certainly spread bacteria, viruses. Besides, it's gross. It is. And, gross. and socially unacceptable. Yes. And you know what? If you have those no nose boulders, or as you refer to picking mm -hmm. for gold, use a saline rinse. That's use what, a neti pot. That's use exactly a right. Tissues. Saline rinse and yes. a good tissue. Exactly. And you're clean and good to go. Yes, but don't pick your nose in public. No, no. don't. Mama Monica has spoken. That's right. And wash your hands. Monica, <laughs> wash thank your you. Hands. Wash hands thank you very much. Thanks, Monica.